hello hello you guys what's going on it is your girl intuitive this is going to be for cancers only so if you're not a cancer and your sun moon venus or rising or your pluto or your mercury go ahead and exit or you can continue to watch i would love to have you go ahead and hit that like button and become a part of into mca but go ahead and hit that subscription or subscribe button sorry y'all it is 12 o'clock and i'm kind of tired but i'm gonna go ahead and do this reading for you guys because i know i haven't been uploading in a little while and yes i'm in my robe because this is what i feel comfortable in right now i'm a little bit itchy from the hair so we're gonna go ahead and start with some beautiful florida water and if you need a paper or some reading, go ahead and follow those instructions down on the description in below. So spirit, go ahead and bless beautiful Kansas with these messages. Go ahead and spill the tea. Please keep all negative energies away from this reading. Thank you, spirit. Go ahead and show all Kansas some of the rising what they need to know for their general reading. This will be about 20 to 21 minutes long. It will not go past 20 minutes. Anywhere above 20 minutes, it will not go past that time. I'm trying to make these really quick and really straight to the point. So, Cancer, let's see. Something is telling me to use which deck. I'm starting off with the Oracle first. Ooh. Uh oh, sorry. Let me see. Um, they said to start with this one. Yeah, they said I start with this one. I have like more tarot decks off to like left, right, and on the bed of me. So they said to start with this one. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to start with this deck. All right. Let's get into a spirit. What's going on for the beautiful Kansas right now? Spirit. Some of Venus and Rising. What is going on for the beautiful Cancer spirit? And what they need to know at this time. card literally click right here you see how it's standing up on a crystal it was like on this side though you look at that i'm gonna keep that right there you got the healing heart and the photograph so someone trying to study you cancer it's that corman that's what it is yeah it's that corman they can't get enough of you and you got the go with a snake right here too look and the sword and the walls and girl with the snake keep wanna come out okay spirit says so this is gonna be the message like all the way around the board you got the healing heart photography sorry no it's not photography sorry photograph so someone definitely looking at your photographs the sword and the rose clarity truth revolution solidarity force honor protection power because this girl with the snake that's who's trying to come at you. Yeah, that's what you need to know, Cancers, okay? All the Cancers. You're healing your heart. And it's probably someone who, hands of cards, who was playing with your heart strings. Because you see how this woman, she got strings right here attached to her. But she's trying to loosen these strings. Like, she's she's trying to get these strings attached back to her heart. She's trying to get the, her heart the, back to the way it used to be. This is talking about Keisha Cole. She goes... Did I get my heart back to the way we used to love, the way we used to feel, the way I used to feel before I fell in love, fell in love with you, yeah, yeah. Sorry, y'all. I love that song. But yeah, that's kind of how it goes. So she basically is saying she got to get her heart back the way it used to because some women playing with your heartstrings at this time though you're like and they looking at your photograph cancers looking at your photos missing you nostalgia making new memories they nostalgic over you because they see you moving the fuck on healing and you protecting yourself but they play with your heartstrings taking a chance risk being strategic options not showing hands gambling they gambled your heart away they was playing with your heartstrings over and over and over so you know now you got this girl with the, with the snake here right here and you're like nah i already see right the fuck through you like you ain't we ain't gonna go down the same road 
empathy and narcissist plagiarism being charmed or used enable boundaries and now you send up boundaries and now these people are like what cancer is not gonna fall for that shit again like i usually cancer would you know give in to me or cancer would have already fallen for the trap and you're like nah motherfuckers like i already been through that same old same old i don't want nothing you got so i'm gonna go ahead and get this deck right here because we gonna see what's really going on spirit when it comes down to cancer spirit what's really going on right here sorry i'm a little itchy <laughs> children so i don't know maybe you could have had a child by this person and they try and take you away from your kids but you definitely trying to heal your heart cancer your love life is being affected by children so maybe you're gonna get pregnant or you are pregnant or maybe this person got kids and they didn't tell you or they got kids and them kids are what's come in between y'all even though it, it never should be like that but i'm not saying it is but i'm saying maybe these kids are are bad or maybe these kids have been lying on you and your person or been telling you know the other person like their mom and daddy like hey you know mom or dad got a new person and you know we don't like them and that and even though them kids don't even know you they got kids gotta say in a kid's place yeah check them kids or maybe like i said it's the other person who got the kids and they plotting on you heart to heart conversation you gotta have a heart to heart conversation with whomever trying to plot on you cancer honestly discuss your feelings with each other right now swear said you need to be alone you don't really need to be with anyone right now cancer i feel like a lot of people have been betraying you worth waiting for yeah spirit said it's worth waiting for if you want something real and authentic i don't feel like it's gonna be with this person right here because they got a girl with snake so they playing the victim right now divine timing is at work in your love like i just said you don't need to be with no one right now you really don't you need to be by yourself healing and get out your feelings <laughs> get out them feelings true love if you wait for it and you wait for that calling you will have true love come this is the this is the romance of a lifetime unrequited love because the person you were dealing with they would give you unrequited love they love you there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep the relationship going nope and you better let your friends help you because they know somebody is being a motherfucking snake on these streets and it most likely is your person i guess it's your person they after the fool they're getting caught up that song caught up by usher is in my head right now look make the effort yeah and separation is right behind that you gotta make the effort. You gonna either keep making the effort towards someone who's about that lifestyle, or you gonna keep falling for the trap. Which effort you wanna make? The same. Make a wise decision, Cancers, because someone trying to play with your heartstrings, and they definitely gambling your your love away, and they definitely giving it to somebody else who ain't you. So let's go ahead and get into it with the tarot spirit. Yeah, they definitely playing with your heartstrings for sure. And they think it's a game. But Spirit about to show them what the fuck happens when you do that. They thought, you know, everything was kiki kaka when, you know, when it was, you know, you. But now I feel like the roles are being reversed. I don't like that shit. They don't, they don't want to watch you be happy. They sitting back like, damn, like, I really thought I broke Cancer's heart. Nah, you healed their heart. Sorry, I'm a little itchy. I might cut off these braids, y'all. They getting a little itchy for me. A little horse hair. <laughs> I don't mind the braids, but shit. Mm mm. Shit's not it right now. This spirit got angel and ancestors with true punch card being stubborn. So your person must be being stubborn then. Cancer. Whoever this is to you, I don't know. This person definitely being stubborn. That's for sure. What for the energy, man? It's not good. What's the truth about cancers? Right now, spirit, what they need to know. Yeah. Spirit said, you need to be alone right now. You don't really need to be with anybody. And you need to basically go ahead and do your own thing. And heal. And be prosperous on your own. 
Let's see what's going on, sir. Why is children here? Look, sister swords in the earth. Because they, they ain't trying to protect themselves. They ain't moving on from things that don't want to serve them. So I feel like, it, like I said, they do got children with someone else. And you know about them. That person trying to make their life harder for both of y'all. And the magician. They are trying to manifest something. You also got the fool here, Aries energy. They want to be the fool. But I feel like this person also playing the victim. And they playing the fool too. It's like they want to be a fool, take a leap of faith. But this jouster right here, you see how he got all these cards in his hand? He a trickster. So this person could be trying to come in and trick you with falling in love with them. Because this magician, this warlock, he is very powerful. And you're very powerful too, Cancer. You don't play. Look, Nine of Pentacles, Leo energy. Yeah, you trying to slay whomever this is because you know you deserve true love. And you've been waiting for it. Yeah, you've been waiting for it. You're like, I don't want that toxic shit in my life. I am so good. I've been waiting for it for a very long time. And I feel like whoever this is who's been watching you grow apart from them, they kind of catching more feelings than they thought that they have for you. Like, damn, like, cancer, really? Why this car going? Look, the three of goats. Oh, child, look at this shit. This person mad, bruh. Because the game being reversed. I don't know. It ain't you. <laughs> Cancer, I'm telling you, there's somebody else in, in this picture here. I don't know who's in the picture, but they in the picture. That's why you got photograph. Not photograph, sorry. Yeah, photograph. Um, Queen of Swords. You need to protect your energy. You need to protect what's rightfully yours. You know, Spirit said, be, like I said, be very cautious of this person. The two of cups. They got love for you, Ace of Pentacles. They want to grow something. They want shit to become solid. Nothing can grow if you don't water that shit, if you don't give it sunlight. This person has to water the relationship. They have to put light into it. They have to make the photosynthesis happen for themselves. And now they know they got to grow roots first before shit can grow. They didn't learn that. They didn't know they had to grow the roots first. They had no I fucking idea that they had to grow them roots for us. Now they learning. Mm-hmm. Look, not the ones with ten of cups. And they drown in emotion for you, Cancer. You see all this water here and this small fucking sea monster? <laughs> Pay the swords. Here they come. Because something is ended in their life. And now they look like a motherfucking ghost. And some of y'all could be ghosting this person. But you see all these holes in, the, in this window. This person got so much baggage so many open broken wounds that is making them go to straight ghost mode like you can't see me like you you can't see me but you can't you i you see right through the bu fucking bullshit like Nicki Minaj said you see right through me and you see right through the ass shit look like i said eight of wands a lot of communication gonna be coming for this person it's gonna be coming really fast because they ass is on fire with this night of wands yeah with the sun they on fire right when i said fire look came out leo energy they on fire for you burning passion ignite love lust the chariot but they gotta be fucking patient something they don't know about they have never learned that patience is a virtue now you're gonna teach them about you know coming in and just coming out of their life whenever they think they can and can't spirit said yeah no they gotta learn that lesson they have to learn they have to learn a little world numbers. Yeah, this person is definitely going through a, a, a karmic revolution of understanding how to treat people and how to love correctly. But it's worth waiting for. Three of Wands in the verse. Yeah, they don't know what path they need to be on. They still stuck right now. Six of Cups. They don't know who to invest in. The Hierophant. But they will learn this lesson. You've learned the lesson out of Swords. You you gonna put your guard down, but Spirit said not right now. They are still putting their guards up. You letting them down. You trying to let them in, but they're not trying to let you in. And that's what sucks. Look, the Empress, and you an Empress. You a goddess. You a divine motherfucking feminine. You a shapeshifter. And they sitting back watching and like, damn, cancer really do all this shit. And I just really keep fucking it up as they supposed to though. So that's what they're supposed to do. They're supposed to keep fucking it up so they can learn. Spirit said, but they're going to learn eventually. This chair, it can't the energy. They're going to learn. Look, and if not, they're going to miss this motherfucking opportunity. And that's going to be their own fault. Yeah, that's going to be their own fault. But I'm spirit. Yeah, look, two of one's worth. And you're not going to let this person get toward, come towards you. 
not spiritually, mentally, physically, or emotionally expressing. Nope, because they don't deserve it. They don't deserve your love. They don't deserve any of it. But it's worth waiting for. Spirit said, right now, you don't need to be with no one anyway. It's an ace of swords in the verse. Because, you know, you got to protect yourself. World in the verse, if you do this person, you're going to be in regret, Cancer. I promise. You're going to be in so much regret, it's going to kill you. Like, yeah, the hangman, because they're still going to be playing with you. I don't want this person who's coming towards you is very genuine right now. They're in lustful ass energy, and they're just looking for anybody to basically lay with. They're not really looking for something solid. They're not. They're not. At least right now, they're not. Maybe next month or maybe next week. But right now, they're in that lustful or oh, I just want to fuck energy. And that's not what you want to do. Don't lay it with someone like that. Look. The will of fortune. This person is trying to make the will of fortune come in their favor. But first, they got to stretch their back. You see how this person is getting their back stretched by spirit? Yep. That's what they got to go through. They got to go through this whole cycle of, of, of back fucking stretches and learning how to be flexible and learning what's right. And spirit about to teach their ass a fucking lesson. Spirit is like, oh, no, y'all, you thought you was going to run a game of us? No, nope. Look, nope. And they finance is going to be hindered. Like, they shit is going to be fucked up. Like, it's all because they don't went down the wrong path. Messed around. Look, three pentacles in a verse, and they got to end something. By being this hangman energy. Yeah, spirit is not going to let them win. And they see you becoming a star. Seven of cups. And they regret. And you being patient. Ain't they not thinking properly? But they want a brand new world with you. Child spirits ain't full of shit right now. <laughs> you don't know they full of shit. Spirits say, yep. But that's what they gotta do. That's what they gotta do. So let's see what this person wanna say to you right now. So sorry, y'all. I just have to keep like moving the robe a little bit. That'll be cool. Let's see what they wanna say, spirit. What does this person wanna say to cancer? Look, straight up. I am not available. <laughs> they know we're not available to you, and they know. Probably let this person go for a little while. But it is what's going to be. So, Spirit, what does this person want to say to the Cancer? Look, I left. I hide behind material things. Look, mm hmm. This person hides behind money, sex, drugs, addiction, whatever they want. They hide behind mama, daddy. They hide behind the truth because they know the truth. They can handle it. So, they write is watch you. And I say nothing because they know they, they feel the shit. We will be together. <laughs> what the fuck did I just say? For some of y'all, it's a wrap. For some of y'all, it's just for right temporarily till they learn their fucking lesson. Y'all know they gotta learn their lesson. Y'all know we gotta go. Look, and it's time for me to heal right now. Uh huh. Yeah. So I said, they gotta do a lot of healing, a lot of introspection. They have to do this. They need to do this for themselves. It's not you, it's them. I'm not saying it, it ain't you sometimes, but it's mostly them. Shit, but ask yourself, what did you do to let them do that to you? I feel you leaving me behind. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, they know it. They know you about to get on this horse, but get in your saddle and ride to the fucking bottom of the fucking ocean without them. And they don't like that shit. They, you about to ride that motherfucking that fucking that wavelength of just straight peace and straight happiness and they want to be on that with you they want to be on that that ride they can't find you shit trying to find them lucky charms <laughs> shit look i wish i could take back my words and for a lot of y'all they said some real fucked up shit yeah they said some real fucked up shit like some shit you be like um excuse me like i know you did not just come from my mama like <laughs> Like, look, you and I were too young. Yeah, but some of y'all, y'all could have met when y'all were young. Maybe this person need to grow up in the in the mental space. I know I mess everything up. They know. I want you and I love you. Cancer. They said, I want you. I love you. <laughs> and now they're fucked up. And they can't stop thinking about you. But we need to let each other go. Mm-hmm. I'm a so attractive cancer, man. They love the body. They love your body. Enough of those messages. Let's go ahead and go ahead and uh, get the last final messages. And that's going to be it, y'all. So we're going to see 
what zodiac signs or planet or um sign y'all need to go ahead and look out for so spirit when it comes down to this cancer reading what do you need to know for the zodiac signs or planets so look out for the mars look out for aquarius that's air sign energy and then look out for the sun sun card is like fire so aries leo sag and aquarius and mars so aquarius and mars or aries leo sag and their mars mars meaning like sex no not sex sorry i do believe pluto is the planet of sex mars is the planet of you know basically grounding i do believe because i'm not 100 percent sure but don't comment that y'all so with that being said, that is going to be it, you guys. Remember to like the video, subscribe to MCA. I would love to have you guys. And go ahead and share this video with friends, family, lovers, whomever. Go ahead and share it on your TikTok, whatever the case may be. Until next time, goodbye, guys.